the green. Um, one person got it right and I sent the wrong answer. So that, that's that. I can also look to see who answered what. Okay. And then I can also see how long it took them if I'm doing a timed thing and I want to know how far, how fast they got it. Um, so that would be one type of question. I, there are six different types of questions you can ask. You can ask a true false question. Okay. You can ask. Well, that's a, <laughs> this one they hate. Um, <laughs> what, what, what is this for the following holidays in order from the first so of the year to the last? You are going to see that you have six choices there. Okay. And then you put them in order. So New Year's Day comes first, so you would hit D first, and then it eliminates D as one of your choices, and then you can go All right. from cool. there. Cool, very <laughs> interesting. Um, there, what else do we have? Oh, this is where they get to text in their answer. So just like they would text on a cell phone, they would text in their answer um, up to the board, and then I could see it, um, see how they're doing. Uh, this would be a number question, okay? Mm. Um, and then last but not least, they, I have scales too. So if I can say to you, do you understand this concept? They don't have to be embarrassed to yes. not understand something. Yes. They can just type it in. No one knows what number they have unless the kids tell everybody. Because I've randomly mm -hmm. assigned them. There's no alphabetical order. There's no nothing. But each child knows nice his idea. number. It always was embarrassing.